Hello, it is currently 7 a.m. here on the East Coast. We decided to take a day trip out to uh, New York Comic Con and uh, see an old gaming friend of mine. And we're leaving at 7 p.m. back to Los Angeles because we had to go to TwitchCon. Maybe we'll see something cool. Made it to the city. The car ride was supposed to be 20 minutes. It turned into two hours. New York's traffic, I guess. One of my favorite places in the world. Much better than California because if the people here don't like you, at least they tell you. You have to. That's for Lily. I'm not buying Lily anything. She'll see this vlog and know I thought about it. Uh -huh. Lily, I thought about buying this for you, but I didn't because I don't want to bring it on the plane and to San Diego and we're going to be at TwitchCon. You're going to be like holding it the whole time. It's not going to be good for any of us, but just know that I thought about it. I heard the Marvel Snap booth is going to be a thing here. And as you guys know, I'm trying to get into the next Shang-Chi movie. So I'm checking out all things Marvel. Marvel Snap, it's all about the cube. This is your entire life when you play Marvel Snap. All you care about is cubes, and that's why there's a giant cube. We'll check that, we'll check, we'll go in there later. Here we have a little, a little set. Uh, you see Spider-Man peeking out. People trying the new Marvel Snap game that's on the phone. These are all people lining up to check out the cube. I'm really curious. Someone said like, if you go in, like you might throw up or fall down or something. It's like, it's like you can see a lot of like flashy lights. Oh God, it's just one big cube. Oh. My God. <laughs> like, it's on some screen, but not on the others, so these are all, oh, I can see, I see why they now they call it the Infinity Cube. It just keeps going. These are all the Marvel Snap cards, a bunch of variants. Oh, sick. <laughs> you good. You know Malt? Malt in the toast? Oh uh, yeah, I've heard of it. Good to meet you. Catching up with Ben is always a treat. The guy was put on this earth to make card games and there's no better front man in the gaming industry than Ben Bro. I love seeing him. I'm glad he's doing well. They didn't prep me at all. Yeah, they didn't prep me either. That's so I <laughs> We're at New York Comic Con and I'm here with this guy's toast. I really wanted to make a game that I could play on the go. Because I, you know, uh, it, it, making a game that's like native for mobile, I think is different than making a game that, that also works on mobile. Yeah. And uh, uh, the speed of the game was really like an, an accident. Because what I really wanted was mind games. And so we made it so the turns are simultaneous and you have to reveal your choice at the same time. And, the, and what that did is it like, made games twice as fast as they would be otherwise, yeah. because instead of waiting for your opponent, you, you're deciding at the same time what you want to do. And uh, I, I love that you can just play a game in three minutes. Uh, uh, have, you, have you tried the mobile version yet? I know you were playing on PC earlier. Oh, I only play on mobile. So like, when I first got into beta, what was like four months ago? I remember, because I was at Disneyland in line for rides, and I was just playing on my phone and why I liked it because it's vertical like yeah. it's very weird because most card games are horizontal yep. but it was vertical so like I had one hand in my pocket just like going like playing my cards and it's every three minutes so uh, it's not that bad if you, like you're in line and it's almost your turn you can finish it in three minutes like you can kind of predict okay uh, it's about I'm five minutes away from getting to the front line I can fit in one like Marvel Snap game because you know there's a there's a limit on time. What I like about Marvel Snap is like, number big, good, number small, bad, and there's three lanes, you want to win two lanes. Very simple, very easy to understand. And like, you could just play cards like, oh, I want to make this number high, I'm going to make this number higher. 
But the fun is in the mind games, the snapping, and the prediction, and the counters. That's when you like really start loving Marvel Snap. Yeah. That's very sweet, Toasty. <laughs> So yeah. you, that's a good thing. That was a good thing. It was so smart of you. Thank you. Okay. okay. Wouldn't it make more sense for him to play something in the middle? Where that's he's what I said first. Oh! He, okay, so he snapped you. Which oh, means God. he wants to play for double the stakes. Okay, you're agreeing to it. Oh, yeah. oh God. Oscar Pokemon. Isaac is here. Go poke him. Say hi. Introduce yourself. I think it's a mannequin. Nice. It's the it's the ramen place from Naruto. It's here at Comic Con. Look at him. Well, that just about wraps up our Comic Con adventures. A few fans, which is interesting, because I think most of my fans would be waiting for me at TwitchCon right now. So it's a nice surprise for them. You guys know me, I always like making the day off my viewers. That's uh, the least I can do. All right, and now back on a flight, six hours, San Diego. Do you go by Mr. Toast now? Yeah. No, still just toast. Uh, sir, sir Toast? No, still, the, still just toast. <laughs> Same as it was five years ago.